So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our great finale for today. <laughs> Last talk, talk number six. And as we heard today, many times the whole industry is changing. And with the change, the customer's needs are also changing. And especially in times of digitalization, IoT, a natural question is how to meet the changing service demands of customers. And that's exactly what our next talk is about. And I'm happy now to welcome one person here on stage. He is application engineer and sales manager at Contitech CBG, stands for Conveyor Belt Group. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Zoltan Torpoi. Was it right, Torpoi? Yes, Torpoi, it's okay. <laughs> Almost. Okay, hey. hi. Hello. Great to have you here. Hi, everybody. So, um, Zoltan, um, please tell us a little bit about yourself and your company, um, that you give us a little, yeah, a little overview about what you're doing there. Yes, thank you for the introduction. As has been mentioned, I am working as application engineer and also have some uh, sales tasks. And uh, I am very often uh, visiting customers, uh, even on places you can hardly find on the map, so you can believe that I know for first hand uh, what the customer demands and need it uh, they have, what they are challenging. And I like my work because here in Continental, uh, we are shaping the way of work, we are shaping the conveyor belt business, and we are uh, shaping uh, the future. Your business unit has set uh, the goal of transforming from a, a developing product to being a full service provider. Um, tell me, how are you making the change? Well, uh, our uh, relevant industries and uh, technologies are changing fundamentally, and we are changing uh, together with them. Uh, we are replacing the outstanding and uh, inefficient patterns with efficient ones. Definitely our place on the top. Uh, we are understanding relationships with our customers as a partnership for joint uh, success. For this purpose, uh, we have set uh, completely new service-oriented business models. Uh, we um, expanded our service portfolio, so we are on the good track uh, to, to be a full service provider. It means we can offer uh, all uh, relevant possible uh, services. Uh, we can offer uh, everything what the customer are needing, and uh, it means we can offer not only a single product, we can offer uh, complete solutions. Yeah, it means starting from uh, planning, uh, design, through all the way through of uh, manufacturing and supplying conveyor belts and different other parts. Uh, currently, we are focusing on uh, networking, digitalization, smart solutions, uh, just to aim uh, to, to get uh, much efficiency and to deliver more value to our customers and make their customers' life more easier. Yeah? Because uh, when we deliver more, we deliver value to the customers. When we deliver uh, value, we gain trust. When we gain trust, uh, everybody is happy and Happy satisfied. is good. Being yeah. happy is good. So uh, we're talking a lot of trends here on stage. So which market and technology trends do you see that um, influence your business? So trends, current trends, and trends in the future? Well, this is a very good question. Thank you very much. Uh, we are moving toward and uh, focusing on uh, services. Focusing on the services and uh, new technologies, as augmented reality, robotics, um, drones. You can imagine uh, how much easier just to make inspection along the conveyor which uh, 100, more hundred or thousand meters uh, long instead of just uh, go through, through uh, uh, walking. We are focusing on digital data, uh, predictive maintenance, uh, preventive maintenance. Uh, we are assessing the data and we can predict uh, how will be the lifetime or when, when should be the maintenance uh, scheduled. So it, it everything makes easier uh, the life for the customers. Uh, also, we are focusing uh, on networking, on sen sensors, platforming, um, smart factories, digital customer access, uh, mobile internet applications, and e-commerce. 
Uh, most of you, I think, are uh, familiar with the virtual reality or augmented reality. Little bit body language, yes, no. And uh, you can be somehow part of the game, yeah? And uh, it is predicted uh, to be more than 1 billion, um, one, uh, 1 billion augmented reality users by 2020. So this is uh, why it's so important nowadays, uh, digitalization and digitally supported services. OK, lots of trends. And you mentioned virtual reality. Um, so tell us, um, what role does virtual reality uh, already uh, plays in your business today? It's already plays a significant role uh, today, and it will be more and more important on the future as well. So what is augmented reality? Uh, you just, uh, it's a technology that overlays some digital data on the, the, on the re real things, on the live video, for instance. Yeah? So it is, uh, uses the, uses the uh, existing environment and adding information on this. And uh, virtual objects somehow make a new uh, artificial uh, environment. Uh, so, so, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. And uh, currently, uh, we have two approach. Uh, this is uh, AR vision, we say. So it just simply uh, visualization, visualization of the belt damage. Yeah. So it's simple. You have a belt, you have a video, so uh, the augmented reality application just adding these damages for the live video. And you see uh, where is some damages or wearing out or something like that. The other option, uh, which is help uh, to, to evaluate the technology, this is uh, augmented reality chart. Uh, this is facilitate communication between a field engineer and the expert. Yeah? So it allows a two-way um, two-way exchange, both orally and uh, exchange the annotations as well. All your examples show that um, the entire industry is uh, changing. Uh, digitalization, big data, and virtual reality are uh, uh, all changing the way we work. So my question is, how does this influence um, the development uh, uh, or, no, no. How does this influence the development of new technologies and products? That's the question I wanted to ask. Uh, that's right. Uh, the whole industry and the customer demands are changing uh, uh, completely and more and more to, to the direction of uh, digitally supported services and digital uh, products. Uh, we, we know, we hear, and we see the demands. And uh, based on that, we put on a completely new foundation uh, our services. Um, Efficiency, proper information, digitalization, and uh, attractive business. In the spirit of this, we have developed some new business models as belt leasing, belt monitoring, uh, leasing, device leasing, and uh, paper tone. Belt leasing, uh, this is a very good thing because I think I would say this is a dream of all of uh, purchasers because you can have the goods on monthly rate. You have no any investments. Yeah? Some other services can be included. Then another, uh, our new uh, service supported uh, business model is uh, conveyor your belt monitoring uh, leasing. Yeah? It's again, you can have monitoring system uh, for monthly rate. And it's uh, everything it's included. Uh, no investment uh, required. Uh, no any investment required. Your equipment and belt on safe. You ensure your, your uh, operator, operating of, of the uh, conveyor belts. It's including uh, all services, all equipment. Again, no investments, and you have uh, first uh, class equipment. All services included as installation, commissioning, uh, software updates, and etc. And a very good uh, business model, uh, which I would like to mention, this is PayPerton. You just select uh, paying uh, according to the value you have uh, conveyed. Yeah? So again, you have no any investments, just paying based on uh, what you already conveyed. Yeah? So it's also very smart. You, can, uh, you, you are on the safe side. Uh, the efficiency is increased. The uptime, uh, this is also increased and availability, guaranteed availability. This is uh, the key uh, here. So let's have a closer look uh, at the customers. Um, 
which services are important for them now and regarding digitalization what about digitally supported services um, of course uh, Continental currently already have a wide range of uh, wide range of uh, conveyor belts and services. Yeah, this is can be conventional conveyor belt. It can be a pipe belt, a special chevron belts, um, trackman belts. And uh, on spirit of this, I would like today talk about two uh, digitally supported smart solutions. Yeah, the first one. Uh, this is a smart rubber track and uh, service material health tracker. Um, smart rubber track, this is uh, with special RFID-based temperature uh, sensor, which is, uh, takes some measurements. Uh, the background is that uh, a lot of uh, uh, heat uh, build, building in the profiles in, in the rubber tracks. And this uh, leads uh, to blow out the threads because it can be the temperature even higher than 100 degree. Yeah? And uh, this sensor is uh, have a, uh, displayed on the monitors and say to the driver, hey, you have to slow down because it's heated up too much. So therefore, this sensor ensures the maximum uh, lifetime of the trackman belt. And we have a very good uh, customer feedback for this product. Uh, the uh, service material health tracker, this is another, um, our new uh, development, which is, uh, helps, helps to ensure the quality of the splicing material. Because usually uh, our customers are ordering or buying uh, several of splicing material, splicing kits, uh, which uh, later on can be stored somewhere. And very important to have splicing material and splicing kit on time on the place, yeah? And not on the only time, it's have to be in good quality. And degradation depending on mainly on three factors. This is a temperature, humidity, and uh, timing. Uh, for, we have a look on this, uh, on this issue and developed uh, three smart solutions. Uh, the first one, this is indicator stripes, uh, which are uh, showing somehow a temperature a limit exceedance. Uh, the second one, this is a USB data logger, uh, which are uh, time by time making periodic temperature log, uh, make humidity log, and also timing. Uh, the data can be analyzed locally. Uh, the smartest solution is uh, GSM uh, data logger, which makes uh, periodically uh, temperature log, humidity log, and also it uh, has some light sensors, so it can log uh, UV radiation as well. And also you can track uh, and see uh, in live where your uh, goods. You have a lot of advantages because you can tell to the customer where, where their goods are at the moment. Yeah? You can also set some limit values uh, just to avoid some uh, bad file storage conditions uh, on the site. And uh, it can be also send notifications via cloud to the customer or, or to, to parties who are uh, involved with it. So the motto of the Hannover Messe uh, 2019 is uh, integrated industry industrial intelligence. So uh, maybe you can show us some smart, intelligent, technologi uh, technological uh, developments uh, from your uh, business unit? Uh, of course. As I mentioned, a significant role has uh, digital, uh, digitally supported uh, services uh, today. And as I already mentioned, augmented reality uh, have a, uh, give a big advantage to our customers. And as I already mentioned, uh, service material health tracker and uh, smart rubber track sensors also uh, just to this uh, purpose has been developed to make much easier the uh, customer's life. So uh, how will service expectations and needs of the customers uh, change in the future? And are there any services already being offered by Continental? Of course, uh, the customer demands uh, is changing. And uh, again, it's more and more for the direction of digitalization and digitally supported uh, goods. Uh, 
to meet uh, the customer's demand, we have to also offer digitally uh, supported uh, services, which Continentals already offers. Yeah? Uh, we have a wide, a port wide range of portfolio, wide range of um, monitoring systems. Uh, we, we also can offer Conti Plus application and Conti University. Uh, our monitoring system uh, have uh, two types. Uh, one, it can be installed on the place. This is a product system, different kind of uh, monitoring systems. And it can be a Conti scan only. You can order uh, uh, scanning uh, for us. And our, uh, our service team just uh, going to the service and make uh, these uh, scannings and inspections. Yeah? Um, Conti Plus application, this is a conveyor belt application, uh, which, which uh, including all relevant information about uh, the conveyor belt. And it uh, makes speed up the information gathering, and it uh, makes easier organization and reporting of conveyor belt data. And it's accessible everywhere and every time. Uh, Conti University, this is a special standardized training concept uh, to also support uh, in this way our customers. And uh, it's developed uh, with the help of our uh, experts. And it can be adjusted always uh, for special demands. And also I would like to mention about our digitalized presses, which means on the site, when you are making a vulcanizing, yeah, you have all different data. But uh, since... Uh, our presses are digitalized and have an internet access. We can even check in our headquarters in service center in Germany the temperature and other data uh, in this, in this regards. So here on stage we're talking a lot about uh, Sweden. On the one hand it's a partner country of the Hannover Mess and on the other hand there's so much going on there. And there's a huge infrastructure project uh, called Stockholm Mega Tunnel, and uh, Continental uh, is is doing a part there. Yeah, and, that's right. Uh, maybe you can tell us more about that. Yeah, that's right. Uh, the number of city dwellers are, are growing exponentially uh, across the globe, and this uh, exponential growth fever has consequences. Consequences are lack of space. Uh, lack of uh, living area, congested uh, roads, gridlocks, and uh, air pollution. Yeah? And uh, this has also affected uh, Stockholm as well, yeah? which is situated on 14 islands and has more than 2 million inhabitants. And uh, this uh, Stockholm bypass you mentioned, this is a 21 kilometers uh, uh, highway bypass. Yeah? And what is uh, very interesting that 18 kilometers, it's uh, going uh, in 80 meters underground. Yeah? So it means uh, when it has been uh, once deployed, it's uh, scheduled for 2026, it will be more than 1,000 uh, per hour, as many as 145,000 per day will pass through this uh, two-way tunnel in uh, six lanes. Yeah? But when you have uh, such a big uh, tunneling, uh, project, uh, you have to, you have to uh, dig up this yeah, process out. And this is uh, resulting in several tons, several uh, metric tons of ru rubble. Yeah? And uh, this uh, rubble uh, has to be processed somehow. And for this uh, purpose, of course, we are participating in this project and uh, developed by technology of Continental. Uh, our conveyor belts are running on the high speed uh, on these uh, queries, which I have to be uh, processed out this uh, rubble and uh, have to be treated. It has to be washed, treated, and crushed as well. And uh, our partner, Yehunter, has a lot of queries. And in these queries, also, uh, they are using uh, our uh, best quality conveyor belts. Yeah? And they can uh, count not on the re reliable and the uh, quality of our conveyor belts. They also can uh, have a smooth operation. Yeah. And we are supporting our clients again in this, uh, in this big project. By the way, it's named Furbifart. 
Stockholm in Swedish. Uh, we support uh, with round clock services, so it means if it needs just a, a, a local, it's a local service. Uh, it needs uh, just a, a local repair of the belt, or it needs a vulcanization or splicing, whatever. Uh, we are supporting uh, our clients in, in these regards. And also, I would like to mention uh, specially, specially developed solutions for drilling equipment because uh, Continental products also passed uh, acid tests uh, for, uh, during the uh, tunneling. Um, drilling equipment from Epiroc, uh, it has uh, three strains, which, uh, uh, which has uh, three drill rigs, uh, which uh, has three strains, and uh, they are put a huge strain on the tires, and this is the reason why uh, this uh, drilling equipment fitted uh, this Continental Drill Master, yeah. and uh, which can, which was um, developed uh, especially for, for the tunneling. Uh, it has a high cut resistance, uh, has a special whip line design, and uh, this is protecting uh, the carcass. And I would like to say that uh, we in Continental always focusing on our customers. Very important, uh, very important to us always to supply the right solution. And uh, believe me uh, that our company uh, can offer and can provide solutions for all cases in all industries. And in case if somebody is not available at the moment, uh, we are gladly support and uh, together with the customer, uh, we can uh, develop a solution for that. So therefore, I would like to say that uh, just hop on the Continental Stray, join uh, the successful story, and uh, let's shape uh, together with us uh, the future conveyor belt business. And yeah, thank you. Perfect. Last words. So uh, Zoltan, thank you very much for You're your welcome. time. Thanks for being here. And uh, this was our last uh, talk for today. And as we call it in uh, German, Feierabend, uh, Danke, at Faust. least for the stage, at least for the for stage, the stage. Yeah, Danke, yeah, just, just for us. So, uh, uh, we see each other again tomorrow. Thank you very much and uh, enjoy the Hannover Messe. Thank you. Thank you.